So vessels can be referred to as stiff vessels or tender vessels or somewhere in between. There's no real demarcation about when a vessel stops being tender and becomes stiff at all. But what it does indicate is the position of G along the vertical center line. This vessel, we could surmise, has a relatively low G and therefore a fairly large GZ lever. This vessel is regarded as a stiff vessel. That is, her roll period will be relatively short. Now a roll, just to understand that because it's sometimes misunderstood, is from the upright position to one side, to the other side, back to the upright position. That completes one roll. Now on a larger ship it's quite easy to time that with a stopwatch or something. A little bit harder on a smaller ship that's rather stiff where she's rolling rather quickly. But what we need to understand is that the roll, the time of the roll is constant and it's determined by the position of the center of gravity. Now you might think if the vessel just inclines or heals a little bit and recovers then that roll period is fairly quick. But the fact is if the vessel inclines even further and then recovers and does another roll it occurs in exactly the same time as if the inclination to begin with was small. That's why sometimes at sea if you're in a fairly stiff vessel with a low center of gravity and that big wave comes from the quarter and pushes you over then it's quite a violent motion because the vessel has a greater arc in which to uh, roll, return to the upright, in the same amount of time. If the vessel only inclines say 5 degrees then the motion isn't quite so violent but the roll period remains the same. If we look at a tender vessel, that is one which has been loaded high so that her center of gravity is up the center line closer to the meta center will have a short GZ that means the lever the writing lever and therefore the writing moment is less it can't return the vessel to the upright as quickly the vessel is stable of course it's still stable but it's going to take longer to return to the upright so the roll period is longer tender ship stiff ship. We can use this musician's metronome to simulate the roll period of a vessel um, according to the position of its center of gravity. Uh, you'll see that this little sliding weight here can move. It's quite low at the moment. Let's just imagine that this is the center line, the vertical center line of your vessel. If I let it go, pretty quick. I urge you to note the distance that it was traveling during that roll too. Let's slide that weight up, raise the center of gravity, and do the same thing. A lot slower, isn't it? I'd urge you to note, however, the distance of the roll remains the same.